I played a lot of racing games on the PS3 era, probably more so than I did with the PS2 era. Split second is one I never picked up. Why? I can't tell you exactly why, but Disney having made it kind of threw me off a little bit. I just couldn't picture how Disney would make a game that isn't a Disney game. You know, like Disney spin-off. Uh, granted, some of the Disney games are quite good, but uh, this one, I played the demo pretty darn good. I never actually played the full game. The menus right away really remind me of Blur, which is a fantastic game. If you haven't played Blur, you need to jump on that as well. I made videos on this Welcome before. Welcome to the show. Good God. <laughs> You've done well on the written test, but now it's time to prove your skill on the track. It sounds like DJ Atomica. We need to make sure you can handle yourself behind the wheel. This ain't like any kind of race you've been in before. I hope it's not. I know you can't wait to go out and start blowing stuff up, but... I'm excited. You better go through the basics first. Let's put the test car through its paces. Drive me a lap around this course as quick as you can. Okay. Meet me back here at the start line. Okay, I'll let's see move you there. It. It's basically the idea behind this game is we are on a movie set. The brake accelerate. We're now to do that. We're now to turn. Please. But this game, I heard, I've had so much praise for it. I'm excited to be finally properly trying it. I bought it, picked it up. I was like, come on. I need, I need a bunch of old classic games. Let's give them a go. So obviously, the one of the reasons as well as to why I didn't really like it so much, and I get why. Uh, the, the break to drifting is very present. Like, pretty much every PS3 game around the same year and age. Let's just break to drift everything. By the way, buy my break to drift t-shirts. They're on sale now, limited time. <laughs> that wasn't even the segue I attempted to do, but <laughs> we'll go with it. Complete a lap. I like how it keeps going though. The slide you've got to actually Good control, job. which is not it. Now you need to earn some power to set off the explosions. I got it. Drift around the track to fill up one blue segment of your meter. Well, that's what I've been doing. Wait, can I actually turn without drifting? Oh, I think I can turn without drifting. Well, that's bloody brilliant. Why not do that in the first place? I'm just not going to drift on this game. No drifting required. But now let's get some skids going just so we can actually blow stuff up. That's the point of this game. It's a little bit different. It's a little bit out there. And that's kind of why I wanted to try it. It's not just like the normal racing game. It has the explosive stuff. So there's a place Great. for this kind of you stuff. Have power to trigger a power play. All right. Drive after the other test drivers, and when you see a target over them, hit the power button to set off the blast. Okay, where are the actual other drivers then? Oh, there they are. They're spawned in. There's a very much a place for this type of game. How about I do that? Oh, well, I meant to do the other one Great. back there. We need to get more power before we move on to the next stage. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Red. Go for it. I'm going to do it. I will get better at this, I promise. <laughs> but I am drifting. It's easy. I don't even need to break half the time. We've got it. We have to get full power. I think that's the objective now. I'm not actually trying to, uh, I'm not trying to kill them. But with me completing most 20, 2012, I don't think this makes sense for me to pick up. It would have made sense for me to pick up whatsoever. Because if I did, I'd be like hypocritical, right? But th around that time, that was all I was thinking. But now I'm like, you know, there's a place for this nice. kind of stuff. Now you can press the level two power button to trigger bigger explosions. Okay, what's the level two button? Icon above the other driver. Tell me. Try it out. Circle. Oh, I gotta, I gotta wait to see it. There's probably like certain sections around the map. That's pretty tense. There it is. What? <laughs> One final test before we yeah. wrap up. Take down multiple drivers using power plays. Okay. Take down. I, I just keep taking them down. All right. So, I've, I've got to say straight away, this is reminding me of almost like an actual burnout. What a burnout would have been if it had, if it kept going. Like Burnout Paradise was great and all, but after that, it was nothing. Par Paradise almost felt like a spin-off. This game feels pretty much like what Burnout would have been if it followed suit, kept going, what it was, done what it done, and take him out. Boom! Helicopter take you out. Burnout, yeah, they, they definitely could have made a Burnout game. Just get these guys to make the next Burnout game, you know what I mean? Oh, perfect timing! Boom! Yes! Did I always damage myself there? I think I might go over myself. Final one, oh, I just missed him. Come on! Get behind something so I can blow you up. You gonna do it? There. Boom! Drop a bomb on him. Yes! All three complete. Good news. You made the show. Yes! Leave us to finish building this set, and I'll see you back here for the first episode of the show. I will see you Good then. Luck. So it's meant to be like a TV show. I thought it was like meant to be a movie thing, and I like that. It kind of masks over the fact that it's a little bit cheesy, a little bit stupid. This wouldn't happen in real life. I'm making it. Oh, it's a game show. I like when games do that, honestly. It lets you pull off, like, spin-offs really easily. For example, Ratchet & Clank Deadlocked. It was a complete spin-off, but a spin-off that I absolutely adore because they made it work properly by saying it's a TV show. You've been, like, kidnapped to do this TV show. Season, which I guess is progression. We've got quick play, online, split screen, extras, uh, split screen, 
It's very old. This is oh. Split Second. Here we go. If you like insanely fast cars and explosive action, you've come to the right place. Well, that's what I came here for. Over the next 12 exciting episodes, contestants 12. from around the world will battle it out on the track with the aim of qualifying for the chance to race There's not the 12 events, is that? <laughs> this band of highly trained drivers are all that stand between the contestants going home and progression to the next round. This is basically Cars 4, isn't it? <laughs> As the contestants choose which events they want to enter. Oh, to okay, there's loads of different ones. Qualify to the Elite Championship race. There we Bridges go. Will fall. Buildings reduced to clouds of dust, and no corner can be considered safe. I like it. Choose your events carefully, and remember to buckle up. I'm it's going to do it. Get explosive out there. See, I could take this more seriously than like Fast and Furious or something because it's 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 fake. It's a movie. All right, so there's not just that many events. But episode one includes these amount of events. So it's a decent amount of events. It's like for an old school racer. We've got elimination and we've got a race. So let's try straight away a race because I'm here to race. Look at this. Oh, look at this meaty mobile. I like it. We've got a selection of a few cars. Oh, we've got like a, a basically like a ute. <laughs> it's a big tall, it's a modern ute, pretty much. Episode one, airport terminal. I literally do feel like I'm playing burnout right now. Let's go! Woohoo! The game does not look that great on my TV, but I know, again, once again, like so most old games for some reason, they look better on the video. But I ain't gonna complain. I'm okay with that. Let's get drift on. Let's get the drift going. Easy pit. Oh, it splits up as well. This is literally burnout. I, it's so. It's literally burnout. Uh, literally a direct se sequel or a spiritual successor sequel thing. This thing feels a little bit different, a little bit meatier. I like the way it moves. I like the way it sounds. This is very burnout. All right. What's. The, oh, oh, oh. I missed, did I miss my chance? Oh, they went round it, the cheeky bastard. Look at the size of him. Is he the Ute? He's the bloody Ute, isn't he? Can I actually take him on by hitting them like that? Oh, trophy. Classic. The ones that used to take about an hour to show up. Excuse me. Oh, just you wait. You might be passing me. But you're in trouble now. Yes. And the building's going to fall on me. No, it just blew up. What's the point in that? Another one. Finally, we got a double wreck. Finally, actually took people out. Does that actually take about the event? I'm not exactly sure. I think they might just respawn right down the road, but... 2.2 seconds. Power boost, man. Black man, man, man Do we have NOS? Oh, my God. Passing the Ute with pure skill in, in mind instead of trying to... Oh, I like it. Things just exploding everywhere. I'm ba it's a battle for... The bridge fell. What? And... How did nobody die from that? We got another one. Draft him. Pass him. Kill him. Hit him. Go and kill him. It's not going. Get another one. It hit me. <laughs> this is intense. This is a damn good racing game. Look out for the bus that almost hit me. I'm literally, I need to not be close to these people because otherwise I'm just going to damage myself. First place. Yes. Now we're ahead. I'm just literally going to save for the big one. I want to see what the big explosion is on this map. What? They're going to try and get me. I didn't realize they could try and get me. That would make sense why the buildings would collapse and stuff. Oh. 1.4 seconds ahead. That's not very far, actually. I see him behind. Woo. Pretty close, but we're close enough, my friends, for the big one. If they do pass us, I think we are right. Uh, one more little bit of a skid, and we're, sh we're, we're, we're bloody dandy, mate. Part of me wants to slow down just so I can hit someone with the big one. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh! Oh, God! No! It's okay. Oh, I just blocked off an X. I just blocked something off. If I was quick enough, I could probably have avoided that and, like, gone through it, and then it would have... Oh, that is insane. That would have made, take down people that were ahead of me. I'm five seconds ahead now. It's already one. I've already got another one to set off. Look at me. I am literally the speedy man. Is this the finish? I think it is. Fireworks and explosions. And across the line. Holy crap, that was awesome. It's it's basically burnout. It's It's... The, the proper burnout successor. 50 credits. Does that mean... Wait, to win... Oh. Wait. Win your first event? I've won I've won without crashing. Look at that! I guess there's like crash cameras as well. 
Amazing. I did a... I smashed them there. They were further behind than that. Come off it. But the race is now gold. Let's go with now an, an elimination event. I'm excited to try these ones. So we were at the airfield at the... What was it? Airport terminal. These two are in completely different areas. Construction or downtown? I'm going downtown. I want destruction. I wanted to try this one. I, the construction site was really tempting, but if I can blow up... <gasps> There's so much ready to blow up. I, I just want to blow it all up. That's my objective in this. Stuff the racing. I don't care. I mean, it's good and all, but I'm, ex I'm wanting to, to blow stuff up. <laughs> Let's get it on, Mr. Race Car Ferrari looking thing over here. I bet it's that big tower. It has to be. Let's get some drifting going. I'm already in third place. There's two big ones ahead of me. We've already got something to fire at them. Oh, are you kidding me? I had to wait for that one. This is literally street. This is a street. What? Did somebody die? I took second place. I think I might have murdered someone. Oh, no. oh it's, a, it's a knockout race. The last place gets kicked out. I thought it was like destroying as many people as I possibly could for this. Right. Well... Either way, I ain't been last. I'm going first. I'm going to win. And now we got another one. Get ahead, get ahead, get ahead. Boost, 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 boost. I wish there was boost. I wish there was NOS. I do miss the fact of NOS. Maybe there's NOS later on. I don't know. Let's go. Yeah, someone just got eliminated. It's like pushed him to the side a little bit. I've got the red one. But, well, someone's been eliminated again. Should I, should I wait for the red one or should I use these? I've got so many opportunities. Oh, I missed it. I'm going to wait for the big one. Part of me feels like I have to be a little bit further behind from these to actually make any, any use of these. Oh, look at all the uses. But no. Hold it. Just stay behind a little bit longer and then push ahead. If I need to, I can take someone out. Circle. Oh, the big one's gone down. I'm in last place now. Yes. Take him out. Double wreck. And that's going to allow me to pass. That feels like cheating so bad. I'm now in first place. Yeah! Excuse me. Just got a bit of slipping on through to do. And there's a big jump as well. This is brilliant. I like it a lot. I have missed out by not playing this game earlier. But now I actually get to play it with you guys. I'm, I'm probably going to do a few videos in there. It's not a let's play as such, but I'm going to play through a few of them. Uh, how many people actually picked up this game? In the comments, let me know. Did you actually buy this game when it came out? Or did you only recently... Well, discover it, or discover it after the generation. Because there's so many games that I didn't play in the time. Like, Pro Street, I didn't play it until I played it on YouTube, I don't think. At least, I don't remember playing it, if much at all. And I realized it was a bloody brilliant game. I wish I could fire them backwards, like Mario Kart. That would be, that would just decimate, though. I feel a little bit bad because of how amazing I would be. All the 50 credits getting me to 100. Eliminator. I did crash on that one, which is unfortunate. I've won. Hello. It's like a muscly supercar -y looking thing. It's definitely not a real car. But, you know, it expects real cars in this habit. Otherwise, they wouldn't be able to blow them up, would they? <laughs> there we go. There's actually a lot of content in this. Maybe I'll make another video on it. Maybe I won't. I have been disappointed in myself because I didn't play this game earlier. I should have. It's. L I'm going to say it one more time. One more time. It's literally a spiritual successor to Burnout, and if you are want, if you miss that classic Burnoutness, you get this. Paradise was good and all, but it didn't feel the same because of the environments were as massively varied. The one thing it's missing is a proper crash mode. Imagine a crash mode on this, though it wouldn't really work because the tracks aren't really made. I mean, the downtown one would. Anyway, <laughs> be sure to smash like, subscribe if you are new, and let me know if you want to see more of this. Until next time, guys. Peace.